Yes, Your Highness. Oh. Oh. You told me to write about office romance. And instead you made a sex tape. Oh. You're fired. Is me? Sir, I think you're mistaken. No. I got testicular cancer. My junk is being sent to the nether realms. Man, do you have the wrong room? <laughs> Whoops. You going somewhere? Just some dumb exercise. I think we were supposed to make a list of all the people that we had sex with and circle the places on a map. Do you have to like revisit all the places? That's actually not a bad idea. I have an idea for a story. I met this guy. He has cancer. What if I relived my sexual history? It'll just be me and him having sex the whole time. Like a do-over. And I really need my job back. You want to revisit all your past romps with me? For my therapy. Are you supposed to not be having sex? You could have one last hurrah. I don't even know you. It's time, man. You just need to get laid. <laughs> Move on. Hey -o! Looks like you just bought that on Craigslist. I did. Like, a while ago, like when Craigslist just first started. Yeah, this is Craig's car. Come to the place. Consider this our Bible. Whoa, all these X's. What's your number? No. How about we say it at the same time? I need to do this. One, two, three. 169. 169. Would you please look at the road? Girl, we could play. I want live posts from the road. I want daily entries on how this guy's dealing with his condition and how sex and love change with age and maturity. Some sanitation, please. Thank you. I'm trying to distract myself, but I'm still terrified. Finding out you have a problem and you don't know how to fix it. That's really scary. Where are we? It's my parents' house. Welcome. No.